Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here you can see, I have imported the background image file. Which I will be using in this tutorial, you can use any image of your choice for this animation. Let's start with creating a new composition, name it as title 15. Time duration to 5 seconds. Remaining everything will be same. Now add image file to timeline. Pre-compose it. Name it as background. Now let's add the text. Here I am using Baba's new font family, font style to bold. Increase the font size if needed. Change to bold and italic. Now add the second text. Add the third text layer. Here I will set all the text layer size to 200. Here you can adjust the position for the text layer, to set the text to center and align them. Now let's pre-compose all the three text layer. Name it as text 1, text 2 and text 3. Perfect. Now create a new solid layer. Name it as shape 1. In effects and preset, search for fill. Add it to shape 1 layer. Here you can set color of your choice. Place this shape layer below text compositions. For this shape layer, you can create mask using the pen tool or select the rectangle tool. Create rectangle mask over the text layer. Perfect. For this shape layer, press R to bring up rotation. Change rotation to minus 6 degrees. For shape 1 layer. In effects and preset, search for drop shadow. Add it to shape layer. For drop shadow, set distance to 115. Softness to 100. Here if you want you can adjust the shadow distance. For this shape layer set opacity to 70%. Now create a new solid layer. Name it as shape 2. Place it below text comps. Select rectangle tool, create mask over shape 2 as shown. For shape 2, change rotation to minus 6. Let's create duplicate of shape 2. We will rename this layer to, shape 3. Adjust the position for shape 3 as shown. For shape 2 layer. Search for fill. Add it to shape 2 layer. Set color of your choice.
copy the fill effect. Now paste it on shape 3 layer. For shape 3 and shape 2, set opacity to 70%. Perfect. All layer are at the place, now let's animate them one by one. Let's start with background layer. Change it to 3D. Press P to bring up position, at one second, create keyframe for position. Now at start, change position value as shown. In effects and preset, search for motion tile, add it to background layer. Now change output width and height value as shown. Select mirror edges. Now press R to bring up rotation. At one second, create keyframe for Z rotation. At start, change rotation value to 60 degrees. Here you can add this scale keyframe or you can skip this step. Only if you want your zoom in effect for background, then you can add these keyframes. You can see the preview. Press U to view keyframes, select all keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Make sure you are on edit speed graph. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. You can see the preview. Now we will animate these shape layers. For this background layer, if you want to remove this scale effect, you can just click on this stopwatch, and all created keyframes will be removed. After that, you need to adjust the output width and height for motion tile. Now for shape layer 1, press R to bring up rotation. At 1 second, Create keyframe for rotation. At start, change rotation to 60 degrees. Now press S to bring up scale. At one second, create keyframe for scale. At start, change scale to 0%. Press U to view created keyframes. Select all keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph. Perfect. Now for shape layer 2 and 3, we will create position keyframes. Add one second create position keyframe. Now at start change position as shown. You can see the preview. Select all keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph. Perfect. Now for text layer, we need to create mask layer for hiding the text. Select the rectangle tool. Set stroke to none. Fill to solid color. For each text layer, we will create shape layer above the text. Just like this. This will be for text 1. Place it above text 1 composition, for text 1 composition. Change track mass to alpha inverted mass shape layer 1. 
for text 2, create shape above the second text layer. Perfect. Place it above text 2. For text 2, change track mat to alpha inverted mat shape layer 2. We will do the same for third text layer. Perfect. Now for text compositions, we will create position keyframes. At 1 second, create position keyframe, at start, change position value for Y axis as shown. Reduce it till the text get hidden. Perfect. We will do the same for text 2 and text 3. Select all keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease, adjust the speed graph as shown. Select text 1 and shape 1, place it at 15 frames. Select text 2 and shape 2. We will place them at 20 frames. Select text 3 and shape 3. We will place them at 25 frames. You can see the preview. Now let's see the complete preview. Perfect. Here our title 15 is created. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial.